Today represents the first 100 days since I've been in office and what a journey it's been for someone like me who grew up in Newham and whose first job was in McDonald's on East Ham High Street. Today I've been looking through photos taken over the past 100 days which I think beautifully capture our diversity as a borough and for me show how Newham reflects the world. I promised when elected that the council would not only look very different but would be different with more transparency, accountability and residents involved in decision making. We've been listening to our young people about their experiences living in the borough what they need from us to feel safe and working with them to help shape better services. And that's why I launched a programme of youth citizen assemblies and already two events have been held so far. The ideas and the passion I've seen from the young people at these events is amazing and I'll continue to involve them as I transform youth services, double the number of youth hubs and improve youth safety. There'll be a review of our whole approach to housing in the borough, including for the first time ever, a survey of tenants living in temporary accommodation and we'll soon be publishing a plan that will show how we are going to deliver 1,000 social rent homes and improve housing quality for all our residents. And we've started tackling the homelessness crisis in Newham with extra money, emergency accommodation and establishing a forum of local charities and people with direct experience to help shape our approach. We're becoming a more open council because it's really important to me to rebuild trust with our residents. That means starting with things like bringing in independent financial experts to help me clean up the books, publishing an independent report on the flawed decisions made previously by the council to invest £40 million in the London Stadium and pursuing legal action against Barclays Bank concerning loans taken out by the former administration. We've started to make changes in the council and with the help of the new interim chief executive, we'll be transforming the way in which the council operates so that it becomes more responsive to our residents. You'll be hearing about our plans to tackle fly tipping, improve air quality, address child obesity and the fair car parking review, plus a whole bunch of other stuff that I've promised to deliver on. And don't forget you're invited to get involved through our borough-wide citizen assemblies coming up in September. These are your opportunity to be directly involved in shaping the priorities in the neighbourhoods where you live. So in 100 days quite a lot has been achieved and I promise you this, I'll continue to drive the change that Noom needs for the benefit of you and all of us. Thank you.